Richard Simmons has spoken. He is not a fan of this biopic that is in production now about his life I, uh, with I, I Pauly think, Shore as the fan. I think you can go I mean, beyond that Pauly and say, the star. say he's pissed. Right. And we had Pauly Shore on explaining why he wanted to do this project and he is going forward with it even though Richard Simmons has voiced his displeasure with it. But now that Richard has spoken out, what does Pauly think? Will he have a second thoughts about going forward? Or push on. We found out because we happened to get Pauly uh, at LAX. Uh, I believe he's on his way to Sundance where the short version, right. the short film that he's made uh, about Richard Simmons uh, is debuting this weekend. Uh, here's what he said about going forward with the feature film. Richard Simmons just came out with a statement saying he doesn't approve of your new film. Anything you want to say to him? Every day is a different day and you never know what he's going to say the next day. If you know anything about me, I don't come from a big vindictive place. I've never came from that. So, you know, I think my whole attitude, I think is if you build it, he'll come. So my hoping, I hope that once he sees the, uh, the short, he sees kind of what we're wanting to do with it, that he'll change, change his tune. I love him and I love what he represents, which is why we want to do it. People miss me and they miss him. <laughs> Well, listen, I think that part that he said at the end is pretty interesting. People miss me and they miss him. Pauly Shore knows that this is a comeback film for him, so he wants to do a good job with it, and I think you have to take him at his word. It sounds like he's a big fan of, of uh, Richard Simmons, and he wants to put him in a good light, so I, have no re I don't think Richard Simmons has really any reason to be upset about this. Well, the thing about Richard, and we know this just because we did a documentary on what really happened to Richard Simmons, one of the TMZ investigates, is that... He just wants his privacy. So that said, Pauly is allowed to do a biopic. Uh, right. You don't need the approval, and oftentimes they don't get approval when they do something like this. And honestly, I, I take him at his word, and I think he's, I, I believe him that this is gonna be a flattering uh, I, look at Richard Simmons. I absolutely Simmons. believe that Richard can rest easy that Pauly's not gonna make him right. look bad. I think for Richard, this is just about once the movie does come out, all the talk that there's going to be all, about it. It all and wells that, back. All that to him probably feels like that's the invasion of. His Although privacy, you know what people it, are going to be talking about. Do you know what's interesting? Much. When we did our documentary, mm -hmm. we were in touch with his people, people and him. they knew we were doing it, and they were fine with it as long as we were accurate. And in the end, Richard actually loved it, right. and and even commented on it. So it's not like. So maybe that's why. Pauly is hoping that That's what I'm thinking. once it's done, right. and if it's good, and I do believe, you know, Pauly is going to, and the producers and director will do uh, a fine job, uh, I guess that's why he has hope. Well, that's Richard... when he said, tomorrow is another day. I right. think that's what he meant. Yeah. Jason from Ohio. Uh, I personally love Richard Simmons. I grew up watching him with my mom, so it's just all good childhood memories, and I think Pauly Shore is just a dead ringer to play him, and I think it would be a really good thing in a positive light. And I just think he has a problem with it because of the, you know, invasion of privacy. He wants to just chill out and be by himself and enjoy his rest of his life. But I think it would be a good thing, personally. You know, I, I love Richard Simmons, and I, I'm, I would love to see it if it actually... Richard Simmons is just such a great guy. Great guy. Yeah.